We're following breaking news out of Gaffney, where police have just announced they've made an arrest in the murder of an 18-year-old from last year. That girl was shot and killed in a front yard on Lincoln Drive. Since then, two arrests have been made in connection with that shooting. 7 News reporter Kirsten Glavin now live from Gaffney with the latest on that case. Kirsten. Well, that's right. Up until today, police have been unable to figure out who pulled the trigger in the shooting. But now Gaffney police say they're charging a man they've already arrested in the shooting death of 18-year-old Jasmine McGill. And he is 49-year-old Tony Littlejohn. He was arrested back in September along with another man, 20-year-old Matthew Archie Jr., in connection to McGill's death. Now, both were charged with breach of peace, aggravated in nature, and police say they got the arrest warrants today and took little John into custody around 2 o'clock. This was a tragic situation that had the community here calling for answers. McGill was shot and killed last August when shots rang out on Lincoln Drive. Police say she was in the wrong place at the wrong time and caught in the crossfire. Tonight, her mother says this arrest is a huge relief. Since the loss of my daughter, I've struggled with this ever since last August. But now I am so, so relieved. And now I can be at peace with myself because I know that she's in a better place. And although it took them eight months, eight months, Gaffney police say this shows the community that they're not giving up on solving crimes like this. Live in Gaffney tonight, I'm Kirsten Glavin, 7 News. Thank you.